Welcome to my first tutorial on building functions in Python. In this series, we are going to look step by step all building functions in Python, first in Python 2.7 and then in Python 3.5. Now you can see all building functions in Python 2.7 and 3.5 and they are sorted alphabetically. In this series, we will go through each function and learn its syntax and use cases. Today we are going to start with absolute value function. Absolute value function is one of the easiest function in Python and it returns the absolute value of an argument passed in its parentheses. If we pass a complex number as an argument, the magnitude of complex number will be returned. So what is an absolute value and what is a magnitude of a complex number? Let's see an example. In our coordinate system, we have two points on our x-axis. If we want to calculate the absolute value of point P, it will be 3 and not negative 3. Absolute value is the distance from origin and distance is not negative. So the absolute value of point B will be 3 and point C will be 2. To calculate the absolute value of a complex number, you square the real and imaginary parts, add them and take the under root. As you can see in our example, it is the distance from origin. In our case, we have calculated the absolute value to 5. Let's have some coding and see some examples in real world. Before I start coding, I would like to give a short overview on different development environments. I am using PyCharm IDE from JetBrains. You can download the community edition of PyCharm from JetBrain website for free. You can also get a professional version for free if you are a student. You can also use cloud development platforms like Cloud9 for free. Cloud9 supports not only Python but also other programming languages. Now I have my PyCharm open and I am running Python 3.5. I have declared four different variables, an integer, a negative integer, a complex number and a float. Now I am calling absolute value function in my print statement. Let's see the output window of my PyCharm. As you can see, absolute value function always returns a positive value or a magnitude if it is a complex number. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe for future videos.